Hello friends, in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you step by step process of physical installation and configuration of Hikvision IP camera system without PoE switch. Also, I will show you how to set up Hikonet application in your mobile and see your CCTV camera video on your mobile screen. So let's get started and let me show you my network diagram and physical connectivity. I already have an internet router from my internet provider at my home and I will connect this with my Hikuian NVR on LAN port via CAT6 LAN cable. Then I connect my Hikuian IP cameras to this NVR via another LAN cable. Here I am using two outdoor bullet cameras and one indoor dome camera in this video. To see the camera display, I connect one end of HDMI cable on HDMI port of Hikvision NVR and second end we will connect to our display monitor HDMI port. After that, I will connect Hikvision NVR with power source and power on the NVR. So this is our network diagram and let's go back to our physical devices and do some physical connectivity. So to do the physical connectivity, I'm going to use this LAN cable and I connect one end to my Hikvision NVR LAN port and second end I connect to my internet router. Now I take another LAN cable and this time I connect one end to Hikvision outdoor bullet camera and the other end into the Hikvision NVR. Let's use port number 1 this time. Let's connect the second camera in the same way. I take another LAN cable and one end I connect to my second outdoor bullet camera side and the other end into the Hikuian NVR. Let's use port number 2 this time. Now I take another LAN cable and this time I connect one end to Hikuian indoor dome camera side and other end to the Hikuian NVR. Let's use port number 3 this time. I hope so you notice I'm not using any kind of PoE switch in this video. So we connect our all three cameras to Hikuian IP NVR successfully. And now it's time to connect the display monitor to the NVR. I have a LED TV at my home and I'm going to use that in this video. So one end of my HDMI cable, I will connect to this HDMI port of the NVR. And the second end, I will connect to my home LCD TV. So the physical connectivity is done and now let's power on the NVR. And here you can see our Hikuian NVR is power on now. And our both bullet cameras and indoor dome camera is power on. And they receive the power from Hikuian NVR over the LAN cable via PoE function. This is the physical connectivity and now it's time to configure our Hikvin NVR and IP cameras. So to show you the configurations, let me take you on my monitor display. This is the first display I get on my display screen after power on the NVR. So here we have to select the language first. I select English here and then click on apply. This is display resolution warning. Just click on yes here. And this display is for NVR activation. By default, the username is admin. And we have to set the NVR password here. I just keep simple and set the password here. We need to type same password again to confirm. So I type same password again. The next is camera activation password. I will not touch this option because I already put same NVR password in my cameras. Next here, I give my email address in case to forget NVR password so we can reset it via this email address and then click on activate. On next screen, we need to set login pattern. You can skip this also but I set easy pattern here and reconfirm this pattern again. So that's done and we are on next screen now. Here first, I set the time zone. I am in plus 3 time zone as per GMT standard. So I select plus 3. Next is the date and year format. You can leave this as it is. 
next is ntp server so i leave it as it is and then click on next here is the network portion by default dhcp is enabled so i keep this as it is and then click on next this option is very important if you want to see your cctv camera video on your mobile screen we need to enable this option by clicking here this need to agree for terms and condition and click on ok after click on ok it's display the verification code and here you can modify also by clicking on this pencil i keep all password same so here also i type my nvr password and then click on confirm here you can see the connection status still offline it takes some time to come online now i click next again and here we can see our all connected cameras two of them is online and third one is in detection stage this will also come online automatically after some time and i click on next again and this is nvr storage stage here you can see hard disk capacity two terabyte hard disk i just need to select this box and then click on finish as i click on finish and here display of my two online cameras third camera was on detection stage that time hope so that one also come online soon and here is it now my all three cameras are online now so here you can see i install and configure the hikuyen camera without any poi switch now in next step i'm going to show you how you can download and set up hikuyen application in your mobile and can see your cctv camera video on your mobile screen for that first i right click on the display screen and go to lost option here exit full screen then i go to configuration and click on it then i go to network and click on it then i go to hick connect and click on it here you can see the qr code to download the hick connect application to your mobile you can download this from play store also but before that important thing is this nvr should be online and here you can see the connection status is offline right now. I already connect my NVR with internet. Just wait a couple of seconds or refresh the page. And here you can see my device is online now. Now I will take you to my mobile screen. Okay, here we are on my mobile screen. And first I open Play Store and type Hey Connect. Here is the application. And now I click on Install. We'll wait until the application installed and ready to use. It will take a couple of seconds and here is it. Now I click on open. And here you know already we have to agree here to go to next. Now here I select the country. I am in Saudi Arabia. So I keep as it is and click on OK. Next here I have to log in. So I click on login. Then type my email address and password to log in i already have an account on hick connect and if you don't just create one account for you now here we log into this application and now i have to add my nvr i click on add device and this will open my mobile camera and i will scan the qr code on my nvr display qr code scan successfully here i can see my nvr serial number also click on add and then click on next and here i can give the name to my nvr it's important if you have multiple nvr i give the name home nvr and then click on save i'm going to skip this but click on skip on top right corner i'm going to ignore this also to save our time and here i click on ask me later that's it and here you can see I add my Hikuyen NVR in my Hikuyen application. Now to see the Hikuyen CCTV camera on mobile screen, just click on this NVR. And here we can see our all three camera display. We also can see our each camera display by clicking on camera display. Now I go back to four display screen again. And to see second camera also, simply click on it. And same thing for the third camera. You can even zoom in and zoom out also so that's it 
for today. Today we see CCTV camera installation with NVR and we learn how to set up Equinet on Hikuyen CCTV camera system. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe my channel. Thank you.